I'm delighted to share these remarks to open the UN Road Safety Fund platform of engagement open day, and to see that we will be joined by eminent speakers across the globe. Your presence here today is what nurtures the strong partnership at the core of the fund. It enables partners to deliver vital support to governments realizing life-saving interventions. The fund has reached in its first five years 36 projects in 46 countries, which is encouraging even if not enough. These interventions cover key areas of vehicle safety, road design, user behavior, as well as post-crash care. From safer roads for non-motorized road users in Ethiopia, to improve speed management in Argentina, to efforts that keep children safe on roads in the Philippines. As a growing partnership, it is fitting that the Fund's 2023 call for proposals welcomes submission from UN as well as international NGOs. And it does this to provide further support on the ground where those are still hardest hit by unsafe roads. Today, I call on all of us in the global road safety community, governments, private sector, international and regional organization to keep disrupting the status quo. The emergency on our road must end. Our goal to halve road fatalities and injuries globally can be met. This virtual meeting is a unique opportunity for us to come together as partners and showcase the real impact happening through the fund's investments and network but also to strive ahead. By exchanging our global expertise and innovation models on road safety, which are building synergies across the sustainable development agenda, we are scaling our safer future today. It is critical we channel much needed road safety financing into more high impact initiatives. I hope you will be inspired by the upcoming expert contribution and collective effort and I invite you to connect deeply with the UN Road Safety Fund's ambition in its next phase. Thank you.